on Danny Garcia from the opening bell. From the first round on, Keith Thurman jumped on Danny Garcia. And what people fail to realize, too, that Danny Garcia got a lot of trouble with people who has great feet work because Danny Garcia don't have great feet work. So he likes to stand there and be able to mix it up with you. And if you got ability to, to move around with a little pop on your punch, um, he gets frustrated because you're not a sitting duck. And what I mean by a sitting duck is you're not an a, a easy target. Because Keith Thurman was giving a lot of movements, but he was also counterpunching off the movements too. Man. And another thing that hurt Danny Garcia, Keith Thurman was throwing a lot of distraction shots to make him move a certain way so he could spin out when Danny Garcia finally get him a position like he wanted. And Keith Thurman was taking that away from him. And how he was taking that away from him, he was throwing punches that didn't mean nothing. It was just enough to make him move. I mean, so, but that was a classic fight. It was close. It was definitely a close fight. I heard Gilly, <laughs> Gilly was on 103.9 hosting it all week. I was doing something. I was in a car driving or something. And I heard, um, <laughs> I heard him, he was interviewing Danny Garcia. Gilly said Danny Garcia got robbed. Uh, and in all reality, Danny Garcia didn't get robbed. He lost the fight. But what was funny was, um, he was like, yeah, um, Danny Garcia was like, yeah, they called Keith, Keith uh, one time Thurman. He said, but I call him Keith run time Thurman because Keith Thurman started running toward the end of the fight. <laughs> but yeah, he called him, he called him. Run Tom Thurman. I just thought that was a little funny, but because Keith Thurman started running toward the end of the fight. But um, toward, toward the end of the fight, Danny Garcia definitely turned it up a notch. But I think Keith Thurman was a little worn out. Um, I just felt like Danny Garcia and uh, Danny Garcia figured it out too late. By then, Keith Thurman already put enough rounds in the bag. But it was definitely a close fight. People said it should have been a draw. Danny Garcia got robbed. I don't think Danny Garcia got robbed. I just think he waited too late to start turning it up. But it was definitely a good fight. I would definitely love to see the rematch, um, see if they go again. I know when Gilly was on a radio interviewing uh, Danny Garcia, shout out to Gilly, the king of Philly, too, was interviewing Danny Garcia. He was saying that he wanted that rematch again. So we see what happens, you know what I mean? But I definitely like to see that again one more time, you know what I mean? So shout out to both boxers, athletes. Shout out to Gilly the Kid, too, man. The King of Philly is a